so actually we're really surprised by Prague we really like it it's a really beautiful city um, it's really cosmopolitan loads of beautiful architecture to see uh, it's almost as if they've had a competition with each other because everything just seems more and more beautiful every turn every corner that you turn uh, it's really lovely um, and there's sweet shops gelato shops actually some really nice vegan gelato which was lovely um, and then actually I think it probably would get quite monotonous because there are lots of souvenir shops as well and loads of bars so had it been an ordinary summer I think it probably would have been a totally different story because there would have been loads of beer laden drunks everywhere but actually it was really quiet so we had the best of it and uh, it was a nice atmosphere not overcrowded and uh, really nice to look around we also found a nice park uh, with a really good view of Charles Bridge so uh, the girls were playing and we could see the beautiful buildings and the, the lovely um, uh, infamous bridge Charles Bridge with all the sculptures on um, and uh, yeah we really liked it we also managed to find some really nice vegan food as well which actually is a little bit difficult in these parts of the world but these uh, cities are quite turned on to it so that's all good um, and yeah, we just smiles around every corner. We really liked it in Prague, so uh, it was all good. of different geezers, um, hot water geezers that come out throughout the town here and they're concentrated into the uh, pipes which they've installed over the top of them. Uh, each one is, is varies considerably, some of them are like 15 degrees and I think the hottest is about 74 degrees so some of them are really really hot. Um, you can see all the mineral deposits around the basin of where the uh, spout comes out and uh, the water tastes slightly different for each one, some of them are more um, sulfury, some of them are a bit more salty, um, they've all got healing properties, they're supposed to be really good for the digestive tracts and metabolism and all sorts of things, so people come here for on a wellness journey and they typically come to stay at the expensive spas which have the water running through the spa, through the whole uh, property, but we are here just to see the, see the actual but the spas themselves. <laughs>
train station in uh, Nove Sedlo. Looks a bit derelict, doesn't it? Yeah, can't even find an entrance, <laughs> a main entrance. So, uh, we think it's going to look. look around the back. Woo! Yeah, it is kind of, sometimes it is creepy when you arrive at these stations in these, you know, certain countries where there's no one else around. There's no, wait, there's no information boards. There's nothing. You've got to just find your way and hope you can, your train turns up. But look, this looks a bit... Hello! Hey. Is anybody there? So yeah, it continues to be uh, quiet, nothing else around, look. It's just us. I mean, literally it's... Like, there's only cargo trains that just... Yeah, it's not... Not even moving. No. We're the only people here. So, uh, it's, sometimes it's kind of cool. But it's just you lot, look. We just the just the Wanderlust Waltons, look, on the track. We've got our own whole, whole train station to ourselves. We get our hotel. Good opportunity yeah. to be doing some more research. Yeah. Especially if you're trained an hour away. Yeah? Yeah. Alright, well, how do we know which platform it is? I Hello! Can anybody hear us? Is there anyone home? He doesn't even have numbers for the platform. Hello! No, no one there. So we'll wait for a train, and uh, if it doesn't come, we'll switch to plan B, which is. Uh, what's plan B, girls? Walk. I'm not walking, Whoa. it's too far. <laughs> so here we are again on the move. Nice early morning bus. <laughs> the best time. <laughs> yeah. No one else is around. Well, a few cars. But it's great. Up early. Nice bit of sunshine. Sunday morning. A uh, little walk to the bus station. And uh, on to the next place, girls. Yeah? Yeah! Woo! And also, because we've had an apartment and we've got an apartment next, it means we've got a great big bag of food to carry as well as yeah. everything else. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah, lots of stuff good. to carry. Right, let's go. <laughs> and uh, we just thought it was a beautiful picturesque town which is why we came actually there's a whole rafting scene so uh, we watched them yesterday we saw quite a few people fall in and uh, lots of people having fun so we thought we'd give it a go today so we've got a raft has just been prepared for us we've got a lot of yeah. Yeah. the girls have got their paddles and, uh, I'm not sure if we're going to fall in or not okay. uh, it's sunny so we're going to go
going on. There's lots of tents, lots of different beers, lots of different wines, a bit of food. Uh, so we've uh, just picked one at random. It looks quite interesting. We'll let you see how it is. 